Well, it is nothing to cheer about. A pair of Instagram photos have triggered an investigation at an East Bay school district. Many say the photos, which show a varsity cheerleading team posing with a black mannequin head, are blatantly racist. NBC Barry's Tom Jensen is in San Ramon, where the district students and parents are perturbed about the controversy. School district officials say they first found out about this on Saturday and they were on campus first thing today talking to students and also calling parents to find out exactly what happened. An Instagram account titled Black Bay Area reposted two troubling photos on their page this weekend accusing the initial poster of racism. The pictures show what appear to be members of the California High School varsity cheer team posing with the black mannequin head they refer to as their mascot which they named Kareem. That is not something that we can accept, nor will we tolerate. Superintendent John Malloy says he's deeply concerned. San Ramon Valley Unified has been expanding its on-campus sensitivity training, and he says he was shocked to see the team share something that seems so obviously insensitive. We don't accept this. We understand that it's wrong, and we also understand that it's harming some members of our community more than others, especially those who may identify as black or African American. A senior we talked with said it has been a hot and divisive topic on campus today. They think it's like a joke or it's funny or something like that, and they don't realize that it actually has like implications. A sentiment shared by a mom who lives in the neighborhood. If they meant it as a statement, then they should have clarified that. If they meant it as a joke, it's not funny. Angelica Tucker has two young daughters who she believes might want to try out for the cheer team at California High someday, and she hopes this can be a teachable moment. It can open up their eyes to the fact that uh, there is no representation that looks like them in the cheerleading squad, and maybe they will be the first ones to do it. She says she hopes the team becomes more diverse immediately so kids like her daughters feel like it's a goal they too can achieve in a few years. The superintendent says the district may need to expand its sensitivity training to make sure another incident like this doesn't happen again. In San Ramon, Tom Jensen, NBC Bay Area News.